So the entire pass of the Winter Contingency 3 operation was just revealed. Those who have stuck with the channel for a while know I've covered this previously, but we didn't know the full extent of the event pass as Previously, we covered this leak showcasing the entirety of the battle pass that comes with this Winter Contingency 3 operation, and some spots you can see are left unfilled, so we don't really know what's all in it, but now we do. As343 just revealed this image on a recent Steam page update, so you guys can see everything you'll be earning for free for the Winter Contingency 3 operation. First thing we see is a pretty sweet looking coating, and we actually do see within the image right here, it's kind of small, but you do see it with the main Spartan utilizing it on their pistol. Then you have some fillers and then another coating for your weapons right here. Some more filler stuff. And then you finally have the first thing, a chest piece, which is what is shown right here on the first Spartan in the center of the image. And apparently if you use that coating, I'm sure you get a nice little wrapped present look to it, the whole thing as well. This is also the coating you can see as well on top of this, which I'm assuming is this one. You can see the gold belt buckle matching up with that and the red and the white, all that other great stuff. Looking down more into it you see more filler stuff right here you got the knee pads right here as you can see you have a new coating right here which is like a green and red camo coating which you see some of the spartans within this promo image utilizing as well looks actually kind of cool and something you might want to use outside of the winter contingency time frame you also have this candy cane belt right here towards the end which showcase right here as well the gloves shoulder pieces which look absolutely amazing like candy cane shoulder pieces i mean yes please this visor does look rather awesome as well as you can obviously tell this is this visor right here it also showcased right here on these two spartans as well where i'd obviously a more eva style helmet you'll really get a chance to see what that visor looks like and of course this helmet right here is showcased in the main image but we have some more news coming our way guys on monday there will be a live stream premiere if you want to call that whatever on youtube at nine o'clock pacific standard time we'll have the winter contingency 3 trailer playing for us now i will be doing a live reaction live stream on this channel guys so if you guys want to catch that make sure you subscribe to the channel and make sure you stay up to date when that ever does go live we did it last time had a bunch of people jump in it was a lot of fun if you guys want to subscribe make sure you do it and if you guys like these kind of videos make sure to tap like while you're at it help support the video and channel and 343 did say that there will be a blog going along with this trailer once it goes live so i will also cover that in detail on the channel here as well most likely covering all the gameplay mechanics that will get people to jump in to play go over the battle pass and customization and things like that all the little details we all crave on this channel now also as a friendly reminder the finish your operation pass for combined arms 343 recently posted this right here letting people know hey combined arms concludes on december 19th and the reason why that's important is because with operation passes they work different than battle passes because the battle passes they stay within the game forever it's a really nice feature 343 did for this game but operation passes work differently where if you haven't purchased into the pass and at that date comes by where it ends then that pass will go away if you haven't paid into it so you have until december 19th to finish out your event pass if you're a free to play player when it comes to that i mean the armor set's pretty sweet you want to unlock that now that we're all on the same page here let's also talk about some of the leaks that we've seen that's been going around talking about the content that might be coming in with the winter contingency again these are leaks keep in mind this leaked image of a remake of live fire called Snowfire, which looks amazingly festive and snowy which gets me excited about this mode but, you know people have requested this for years and years having snowy themed maps when it comes to the winter time events within halo we've done we've seen this previously with halo 5 right when they had like the winter time fiesta now let's do it again but this time in halo Infinite. so it could be like a super fiesta type mode that would just be my speculation we also have some actual gameplay being shown as well delta on twitter here showcasing some of the live action type gameplay if you want to call that i mean sitting in front of some ai grinds and shooting them but just keep an eye but keep an eye on the battle rifle and the attachment obviously on that battle rifle these are most likely going to be the premium paid items that have been going along with the shop as well which i mean that's going to be expected to have these type of weapon coatings a new type of model as well as a package on top of it as well i'm assuming that the package and like the front end of the muzzle with like the shovel probably a whole new gun model completely where that's a coating you can see where like the black and white snowy star thing but i do hope that 343 does some kind of new gameplay style to make it so then people want to play on these maps specifically because if it's just like team slayer on snow maps like 
it will be nice, yes, but it wouldn't really feel that new or exciting to play or continue to play because this event is going to be going from December 19th until January 30th, which reportedly, coincidentally, January 30th should be the reveal or at least the start date of Season 6 for Halo Infinite as well, meaning we're going to get a ton of ramp up of what's going to be coming next for Halo Infinite. We're talking new maps, weapons, things to do within the game. You're definitely going to want to stay tuned and we'll see what kind of details come with that later. So make sure you subscribe to the channel for when that news does drop. We'll cover it 100% as much as possible on the channel. Now, 343 are making significant changes when it comes to Firefight, specifically Legendary Firefight and the XP rates, as well as the networking changes as well. If you guys want to know more about it, check out this video right here. Thank you all for watching. Greatly appreciate it. Catch you on the next one. Peace out.